What's going on everybody, D-Dub here, and today we're looking at the PlayStation 5 DualSense controller, which has just been revealed by Sony, and this is for the PlayStation 5, and as you can see from the pictures, it is this black and white sort of weird boomerang looking monstrosity thing you can see that still has the touchpad which i thought they would get a i thought they would get away from that and kind of do something else you can see the usb c on the top apparently the left and the right triggers have sort of tension to them the d-pad sort of looks like a playstation d-pad that was kind of on like the psp with like the i guess they're clear sort of see-through buttons with the white at least that's the way that it looks the sticks look about the same i'm wondering if that touchpad is going to have any other functionality to it maybe it's not just a touch and drag pad maybe there's something else to it and it kind of looks like there's the speaker slash microphone vent right up above the playstation and it does seem to have a button in the middle with a little light underneath that with i guess a headphone port underneath of that and the playstation emblem button looks like a home button that you could press. I mean, you still have like the same share button, the L1, L2, or L1, R1 buttons kind of look the same. It's kind of weird looking from the side. It sort of has more of like a, I don't know, from the side view, it kind of looks like a, like it's more form fitted to be kind of like an Xbox One controller. Not really sure what to think about that. And as far as the black and white color scheme with this blue kind of going around the touchpad, I don't know, it kind of just looks weird from a distance with the full shot. Now we got the close-up shots here, and that's when it looks more like a controller, but when you look at it from afar, it kind of does look like a old school, like before the PS3 and the PS4 came out, kind of like mock-ups for that or even when the nintendo nx was going to be on the way kind of these futuristic looking mock-ups of what gaming was going to be like in the future before we got there and still had traditional controller shapes so i really think it's just the coloration of it that makes it look a little bit off it looks like it's probably a pretty comfortable controller for being a playstation controller they're the only company that still have the left d-pad up top with the right joystick not being inverted, which pretty much became standard when the original Xbox came out with the Duke. So I don't know, what do you guys think about this controller? I think it just looks kind of weird from afar, maybe with the color variation being different, which we probably will be getting controllers like that going on in the future and up to launch. But this has just been the reveal of, like I said, the PlayStation 5 DualSense controller. I'll be covering more on the PlayStation 5 as we move forward. This is just my overall impressions of it. Haven't felt it yet. Nobody has. So I guess we'll have to see just going forward how this thing turns out. Maybe we get a hands-on impression before the system comes out. But for right now, I think it does just look kind of weird. But I'm reserving judgment until I actually feel the thing in my hand. So let me know what you guys think. This is D-Dub. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Hit that like button. And don't forget to leave a comment down below. This is D-Dub. Have a good day.